to Good Morning Sri Lanka. In case you just tuned in, we have Tamara Raymond, the owner of Life Juice, and we were just getting into, before we went to the commercial break, about uh, the types of drinks that she does, juices that she does have um, in her menu. And I really, you got to know what the immunizer was, but I really, really want to know what the extinguisher does. <laughs> it sounds so bad, like, like, like you know, like, oh, really no, macho my God, yes. yeah, <laughs> like, I yeah, I like that, actually. I really <laughs> did <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like, you picture it, like, if it was, ever was advertised to turn it all in life, like, yeah, it's, it's great. It's amazing. <laughs> what is the extinguisher? Okay, so the extinguisher is, again, obviously, king coconut water, mm -hmm. uh, passion fruit, cinnamon powder, Ooh. and mint leaves. Oh. And cinnamon powder has one of the highest levels of antioxidants in any food group. Mm -hmm. right. So, hence, extinguisher. Oh, there you go. All right. But it's become a trend, like you mentioned, the coconut water has become Very a much. trend around the world as well. But this juice fast, mm. you hear lots of people trying to go on juice fast so that they can lose weight fast and they think that they can detox their bodies. What, what are your t what's your take on uh, this uh, newest fad? I've done it. Mm -hmm. um, I do recommend it, however, mm -hmm. not for everyone and okay. obviously with medical advice. Mm -hmm. um, juice fasting is brilliant for detoxing. Okay. Right? And yes, of what course. What is detoxing really? So basically, your body picks up toxins from uh, pesticides, the food you eat, the soil, mm -hmm. the water, the air you breathe. You can't help it. And as the world has gotten bigger and better and grown at the rate it has, together with that has come all of the other little bits and pieces that we don't really need. Want exactly. And those toxins are then stored in your body in however, however it enters. You obviously go to the toilet every day and you sweat and you mm -hmm. cry and you do actually get rid of some of the toxins that way. However, at the rate that we're producing it, the body can't actually get rid of it. So it's stored. Okay. Mm -hmm. So which is why people recommend a juice fast to detox mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. it helps to detox your liver, your colon, your kidneys. Mm -hmm. And you only do it for a short time, maybe three days, five days, again, on the recommendation of your doctor. Of course. Um, but yeah, so well, any, any advice that we give when it comes to medical conditions, yeah. you should always seek advice from your doctor before starting off any type of special uh, exactly. fast or diet of any type. But yeah. again, exactly. it, there's an idea. The new yep. Maybe you can try a juice fast. And you do well. lose weight, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, you'll also find that you have a lot more energy. You feel really great. Your skin clears up, and mm -hmm. it's it's awesome. Oh, that's great. Then. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I am. Now, now you that. know why I look so great all the time. <laughs> <laughs> it's a juice fan. Well, Tamara and I are just like. <laughs> <laughs> You do look great. Now, what are the precautions that you should take when it's a juice fast? Of course, consulting your doctor is one thing, but what are the, what are the times that you can, uh, how often do you have to consume it and things like that? When I have done it, mm -hmm. it's basically I drink as much juice or as little juice as I want to. Okay. Uh, I don't think there's a hard and fast rule, mm -hmm. but I think if you read up on it, it'll tell you that you need to consume a certain number of ounces per day, and mm -hmm. that's highly recommended, obviously, mm -hmm. for hydration. Mm -hmm. um, other than that, I think it's your personal choice, but there's so much information available on the net. I so see. if you just go and Google Juice Fast, I mm -hmm. mean, there's tons of it. And something that's really inspiring that I watched uh, together with my husband was a, a DVD. It's called Fat, Sick and Nearly Dead. It's about this gentleman called Joe Cross who had a very rare illness. I think it's called urticaria, if I'm not mistaken. Mm -hmm. And uh, it, it causes a lot of other complications. And he basically just ran out of options. You know, he was getting sicker, so he decided to go on juice fast. And okay. he just did a green juice fast for 90 days. 90? And that's all he drank, okay. you know. Was, I mean, that's quite extreme, obviously. Mm -hmm. However, when you watch it, it's just amazing because his entire... Everything just gets reversed, you know. He's just perfectly healthy at the end of it. Wow! Yes, That's and then he, exactly. So it's quite inspiring. I mean, it's it's also quite extreme for people. Yeah. So I'm not I'm not recommending it to anyone. But these are the things that are possible with something like a. Juice there are so many possibilities. Yeah. There okay. are so many options. What are the type of diseases that you can prevent when it comes to incorporating more juices, a green juices into your life? I think when you talk about juicing, I, I think that's just such a small aspect of overall health. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, obviously, juicing, whether it's green juicing or mm -hmm. fruit juices, it's going to add something to your life and it will benefit some portion of your life. 
and it'll help in preventing some things such as maybe cancers and heart disease and mm -hmm. things like that you know diabetes and things like that and those are the number one killers in the world right now mm -hmm. right. so we Definitely. should be more aware of things mm -hmm. like that well I've saw I've seen stats online that say sugar is worse than tobacco that's right when it comes to the amount of lives that it takes that's right. and it's a slow deterioration that's right it's something that creeps up on you and you, never which you don't really it. think about yes. you don't think about it as being a killer you just say, oh it's both sugar yeah. and I just read today actually on the BBC it said uh, at the moment there are 14 million 14 million cases of cancer a year that's reported mm -hmm. but by 2035 that number is going to go to 24 million oh, dear. per year right. per year so and they they that's attributed things like alcohol and sugar and obesity and all of those mm -hmm. things you know and the environment and the pollution mm -hmm. so I think those are real concerns that people need to really wake up and start looking at instead of saying well you know people have this kind of saying yeah but you know one foot in the grave or that's too hard or you know but I don't think we can be that complacent anymore right. of course so take charge is, of your life yeah, this act, yeah. this show is um, how would I put it it's a wake-up call <laughs> to get on juice <laughs> like come on like I'm just doing that so like, but no seriously uh, the juice is what it like it, it's all different you've got different ingredients in every single juice what is the most outrageous thing you've ever put into the <laughs> uh, like mixed into the little juices okay it's something that I actually haven't put out into the store yet because I'm okay. still perfecting it. I don't know if I will. Aha! But it was Garcinia. It's a Gorka. 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 <laughs> in the juice? In the juice. Oh. I use it in Abultial. <laughs> I know that, that's what you do when you have the fish uh, yes. sort of pres yeah. preserve the yeah. fish. But uh, wow, in a I juice? Tried, yeah. I tried it with uh, sour salt, mm -hmm. which is fantastic antioxidant. And Garcinia has got amazing properties, especially for uh, losing weight. Right. And again, it's one of those superfoods that's going around the world. So it's something that catches my eye, then I do a bit of research on it, and then I try to play around because I love to cook, mm -hmm. which is how this was all born, actually. So then I try and put things together and see how they taste. And my family is usually the guinea pigs and, mm -hmm. and my friends. <laughs> and my friends. And they then try the Garcinia juice. Yes, the Garcinia juice. Try it. So it's good. Yeah. Yeah. But now so you yeah. mentioned that uh, how you started up. And that was at the Good Market, it was. wasn't it? The Good um, Market is just amazing. Mm -hmm. It was. It's given me the platform. I actually started there with something else, with another one of the things that I do, which is Firestarter. Ah, which is a seller yeah. of the Good Market, yeah. I've heard. So... While I was doing that, I was just walking around one day and realized there was no nothing to drink. Mm -hmm. So I said to my husband, well, maybe I can do some juices, you know. But then it just suddenly came, well, why don't I do it with family? Because it's just so completely different and everyone does juices. Mm -hmm. So it needed to be a little bit more different. And then because I'm, I'm interested in nutrition, I'm interested in health, and I'm interested in being healthy, it kind of was a nice match. And it's just such a small portion of your day that you can, mm -hmm. you know, that you need to dedicate to such a s small amount of time to do something that could be potentially very good for you, good for you. and exactly. also if you get into a daily habit of it and if you can teach your kids that from a young age you know I think it has a, a lasting benefit and it's more cost effective it than is. using yeah. expensive cereals That's right. for breakfast or you know for even as snacks people are used to some going out all the time but this is something that you can do at home and it's good Absolutely. for you as well but what's the feedback been like from the all the people who tried life juice it's been really awesome I've been uh, quite surprised uh, pleasantly mm -hmm. um, the good market has given us a very loyal following mm -hmm. uh, so we have very regular customers including children which I love who come oh. to grab the juices oh. and the kids will ask for it without the kipple which just blows me away I just, just <laughs> love that so wait, is there like a separate uh, type of juices for the kids no nope. they just, just come and have the juice oh, which I just that. love you know I just I love watching the kids reaction mm -hmm. um, and from that uh, we grew and now we've got our own little counter at the Dutch Burger Union, which is in Colombo Four. Okay. At the VOC Cafe, so we have a st we have a counter there. And in the month of March, we'll be moving to Park Street News in conjunction with the Good Market, who's opening up like a, a whole food store where you can go and get your organics every day. Wow, that's yes. good news for it everyone out there. It's amazing. Well. It is an, good news. An announcement here on Good Morning Sri Lanka. It is. It's you have just heard it here <laughs> on Good Morning Sri Lanka. And there's it's one more. And the Good Market will also be opening on Saturdays at the race course from next month. So wow. three days of Good Market, which is brilliant news for everyone. Exactly. Because there's such a big demand for Huge it. Huge demand. People are just trying to find the time to visit the Good Market exactly. often. And now it's there three days a week, so that's brilliant. And well. I think that's indicative of the 
of the shift in consciousness of, of, of the country. Mm -hmm. You find that people are becoming more health conscious mm -hmm. and I think the, the government's done a fantastic job with all the new pathways to walk and the cycle mm -hmm. tracks and that's encouraging that movement as well. So it's been and wonderful. And it's helping as well. I mean, it in is. the evenings you can see it's so many people out on brilliant. the walkways. Yeah. Exactly. So like me, I'm yeah. walking usually. Like, come say hi. So to help with those people who walk, actually, we open the, to the juice bar at 7 in the morning at the DBU. Okay. So the people from Independence can just basically, they come down there mm -hmm, and they grab mm -hmm. a juice. And because Thambili is, uh, is the perfect hydrator. It's got mm -hmm. so, much, so many electrolytes in it. So after a walk, one, whatever you do, it's perfect to just come and grab a juice. You revitalize yourself. You do. You do. No, we just have a few minutes left. But I want to ask you, why life juice? Is that an obvious question? Because... Uh, I think the name says a lot about the product mm -hmm. and actually just recently I read something that somebody else had written about Life Juice and she said she was attracted to, she's a journalist and mm -hmm. she'd written a little write up which I didn't know about which is lovely again and she said she was attracted to it because it said life. life. Because okay. I want to portray the image that it is of benefit mm -hmm. right. and that life is precious, you know, it's something to be enjoyed and why not? Why not? Of Maybe course. a slogan, let there be life. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Jason. <laughs> Thank you. I don't know where I come up with these things. I know. There's, there are some real gems that come yeah, up with real gems. Lots, right? <laughs> but uh, as a final message to all our viewers, I mean, what can we leave them? And what, what's the importance of really adding these raw, sort of natural ingredients and natural foods into their life? I think, <clears throat> in general, I would, I would uh, suggest to everyone, it doesn't take much to make small changes. You know, cutting down a little bit of something like carbonated drinks, you mm. know, the Fantas and the Sprites. And having water and a juice instead mm -hmm. is a great start or mm -hmm. listening uh, decreasing the numbers of coffees or tea you have and then adding a juice mm -hmm. or you can skip a meal and have a juice mm -hmm. that just kind of you know it just uh, it'll help you to lose weight it'll give you more energy it'll help you to feel better uh, and I think those are like nice small little baby steps on your way to health of course yeah. so we've had some uh, sort of markers that you can have on the way to a healthy lifestyle as well and we've had Tamara Raymond on the show who's been Amazing. very explain yeah, yeah and very eloquently all too I might add <laughs> Thank you. why it is very important to really incorporate uh, so a lot of health foods into your lifestyle and to really make a change now rather than later because prevention is always better than cure it's a cliche Amen. but it's true that's <laughs> right so if you want to look as good as I do you know what to do. Thank no, you so thank much, Tamara, for so being, so. being with us on the show. And yeah. it was a pleasure you. to have you here thank this you morning. Jason. Enjoy the rest of your mm -hmm. day. And that's it from Jason and I yeah. on Good Morning Sri Lanka as well. Yeah. We hope you have a great, healthy day and a great, healthy weekend yeah. ahead as well. And we will see you on the other side on another great episode on Monday morning. If so you want to also find out more information about Life Juice, you can uh, go on Facebook, mm -hmm. type the keywords Life Juice, and obviously find the Facebook page. If you want to find out more about the show, you can email us at mtvsports at maharaja.ok. Again, good morning Sri Lanka, be good looking like me. <laughs>